students today is 28 and today we are going to do unit 8 and we have to do the question which yesterday we made only one question we, we did the question what makes a nature poet a poems appealing to you is we have done and the first one we have not done does the title reflect the theme of the poem? Now, that look at the picture and look at the title. So, the title tells us that uh, the title Stopping by the Wood on a Snowy Evening tells us that, uh, that Robert Bruce, who is the poet uh, name? Robert Frost. Robert Frost uh, was impressed by the natural beauty of woods covered with snow and he with the snow while on his way through the forest he was passing through the forest and on his way he saw the woods because you do not, not stay in the forest but you are going to pass through or you are traveling through the forest so he was passing through the forest and he was impressed by the woods covered with the snow while on his on his way and what was the timing evening so snow falls in winter and evening so it was evening time and it was a time of winter the title does tell us that it was winter because snow falls only in winter and it was evening time and he stopped to kept to admire the beauty and wrote a beautiful poem which describes its beauty. So this poem is related with the beauty of the nature. He was a poet of nature. That's why he, he was he was impressed by the, the uh, common people would have just passed. Oh, it's very beautiful and would have passed away. But the poets are always have a deeper admiration for the beauty. So he stopped there to admire the beauty of nature and he wrote a beautiful poem.